Imagine a force equal to 50 million tons of TNT. That's the Tsar Bomber, the most powerful nuclear weapon ever detonated. This terrifying device represents a peak in human destructive capability. On October 30th, 1961, the Soviet Union tested this monstrous bomb. The event sent shockwaves, both literal and figurative, across the globe. The Tsar Bomber became a chilling symbol of the Cold War. This wasn't just a weapon, it was a statement. The Soviet Union wanted to showcase its military might. The world watched with a mixture of awe and terror. The Tsar Bomber served as a stark reminder of the fragility of peace. It forced the world to confront the potential consequences of unchecked technological advancement. To understand the Tsar Bomber, we need to understand the Cold War. After World War II, a new conflict emerged. The United States and the Soviet Union became locked in an ideological battle. Both superpowers possessed nuclear weapons. This created a dangerous atmosphere of distrust and competition. Each side sought to outdo the other in military might. This arms race had a profound impact on global politics. The development of increasingly powerful weapons like the Tsar Bomber became a terrifying side effect. Fear permeated every aspect of life. The world lived under the constant threat of nuclear annihilation. The Tsar Bomber was an extraordinary feat of engineering, albeit a terrifying one. It was a thermonuclear weapon, also known as a hydrogen bomb. These bombs utilize nuclear fission to trigger a more powerful fusion reaction. The result is a massive release of energy, far exceeding that of atomic bombs. The bomb's design was incredibly complex. It involved multiple stages, each contributing to the overall yield. The Soviets initially intended for the Tsar Bomber to have a yield of 100 megatons. However, they reduced this to 50 megatons for the test. Even with this reduction, the Tsar Bomber was still hundreds of times more powerful than the bombs dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Section 4. The Test and the World the Tsar Bomber was detonated over Novaya Zemlya, a remote archipelago in the Arctic Ocean. The explosion was nothing short of apocalyptic. The mushroom cloud reached an altitude of over 40 miles, visible for hundreds of miles. The shockwave from the blast circled the Earth three times. The test had immediate and long-term effects. The heat from the explosion caused third-degree burns at distances of over 60 miles. Buildings were destroyed hundreds of miles away. The blast created a seismic shock measurable around the globe. The radioactive fallout from the test spread far and wide, contaminating the environment and posing health risks. Section 5. A Legacy of Fear The Tsar Bomber stands as a terrifying reminder of humanity's capacity for destruction. It serves as a symbol of the Cold War's excesses and the dangers of unchecked technological advancement. The test had a profound impact on international relations, contributing to the signing of the Partial Test Ban Treaty in 1963. This treaty, a small step towards disarmament, banned atmospheric nuclear testing. The legacy of the Tsar Bomber is a sobering one. It reminds us of the importance of diplomacy, international cooperation, and the need to control the spread of nuclear weapons. It serves as a stark warning from history urging us to seek a future free from the threat of nuclear annihilation. If you found this video informative, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more content on history and technology. Thank you for watching.